Hello everyone. In this video session, I am going to explain part 179 of Java for Tester series, that is private access modifier. So private access modifier. In Java, this private access modifier can be used with three things. That is variables, methods, and constructors. Okay. You can use this private access modifier with uh, these variables, methods, and constructors. And if you try to use this private access modifier with classes, okay, in Java, if you try to use this private access modifier with uh, classes, you will get compiler error. So you cannot use this private access modifier with classes, guys. Okay, private access modifier can be only used with variables, methods, and constructors in Java. So fine. If you use this private access modifier with variables, methods, and constructors, what will happen? Once you specify these variables, methods, and constructors with this private access modifier, they cannot be accessed outside the classes, okay? Outside the class in which they are created. The variables, methods, and cre constructors created in a class, okay? They can be only accessed within the class, but if you try to access them outside the class, you cannot access, okay? They can only be accessed in the class where they got created, okay? Where they got created. The class in which they got created, in that class itself, they can be accessed. Once you mention these variables, methods, and constructor as private, they cannot be accessed outside the class. They can be only accessed inside the class in which they are created, guys. Let me practically demonstrate the same, guys, okay? So for that, I will create some class, guys, say class A. Class A and click on finish. Okay, and inside this class, I will create some variables, methods, and constructors. For now, I will simply use public, guys. So later, I will change it to pri private. Okay, let's start with the public. Public int a, then public void, the method a. I'm just creating variables, methods, and a constructor also. Okay, public class a. For now, the access modifier that is specified before this class or variable or method or constructor is public everywhere it is public guys okay i'm going to change this public to private and show you what will happen okay now let's create a new another class guys let's let's name this class as class b click on finish inside this class we'll create a method sample method like uh, public void method b fine so let's uh, keep this in these things ready we got these things ready now. So what I'm what I'm going to do is uh, I would like to make this class as private. As explained, private access modifier cannot be used with classes. If you try to use this private access modifier with classes, you are going to get compiler error. Let's see whether that is happening or not. Okay. Here you can see guys, there is a class here. There is a class here, class A. And if I make this public to private here, okay. Instead of public, if I am giving the private access modifier, immediately I am getting a compiler error, guys. Illegal modifier, it's saying. Okay illegal modifier you can only use public or other permitted things okay public or other permitted things can be used here so here you cannot use private it is saying indirectly it's saying it's an illegal modi modifier and you cannot uh, use other than public and all okay so you cannot use uh, private here so again i will making i am making it public case okay that's just for demonstration if you use public then only it will work if you use private here then you are getting a compiler error saying that illegal modifier right okay so private cannot be used with classes, okay? We cannot specify the private access modifier with classes. We try so, we are getting some compiler error, right? Now let's try to use this private with variables. As you can see here, there is a variable A, which is uh, specified with public access modifier. I'll change this public to private here, okay? I'll change this public to private. Now, since this class is public, okay, this class is cannot be private. It is kind of public here. I'll I'll try to create an object for this class, guys. Okay, first let me create an object for the class class A. A object is equal to new class A. What will happen, guys? So they will not give any error because this class A is of is specified with public only. Okay, as we cannot specify the private access modifier with classes. Okay, I just kept it as public because I'm directly getting the error. So I cannot keep private here. So that was not possible. So I made it public. So since this class is uh, specified with public access modifier, okay, I'm just creating an object for this uh, class, which is having specified with public access modifier. Okay, up to here is fine. Now 
I made this variable a to be specified with private access modifier. In this kind of situation, if I try to access this variable a, can I access guys? Okay, from outside the class. This class B is a separate outside the class of class A, right? Outside the class A, if I try to access this variable A, which is specified with private access modifier, will that be possible or not? Let me try this A object dot. Am I getting A? No. There's no possibility of accessing A, guys, because it's specified as private type. Okay. This variable A is of private. So you'll not be able to access outside the class. You cannot access this private specified variable. Okay. They can cannot be accessed outside the class. They can only be accessed inside the class stage. So let's try see whether we can uh, we can access this variable inside the class. If I say system dot out dot print yellow. Okay. If I try to print the value of a, the value of a is okay plus a like this. Okay. I'm trying to access this variable inside the same class in which it got created because it's of private type. You see, I'm able to access it, guys. I'm not getting any compiler error. Error, but if I try to access this okay, like this, the value of uh, a is plus a object. Using the object reference, we have to access guys because this is a separate class. So object a object dot a. I have to access like this. You see, I'm getting error saying that uh, is not visible. Okay, it's not visible because this is mentioned as a private. If I make it public, I can access guys. You see, the error will be resolved when I save it. You see, error got resolved. The compiler error has been gone. Now I'm able, now I'm able to access the variable a, which belong to the class a because it's public. The moment I make it private, I'll get the compiler error, guys. Okay. You see, I'm getting the compiler error saying that uh, it's not visible. So if the variable which is specified with private access modifier cannot be accessed outside the class. This proves that. Similarly, this method a. Okay. So currently, this method a is specified as public. So if I try to access uh, using this object reference, a object dot uh, method a, I'm able to access, right? I'm able to access this method a because it's specified with private public access modifier. Public means you can access from everywhere. In the inside the project, you can access from everywhere. But once the moment when the moment when I make it make this public to private access modifier here, okay, and save it, you see I'm getting a compiler error saying that is not visible. Okay, I'm not able to access guys. I'm not able to access the this method because it's private now okay so such kind of private methods can only be accessed can only be accessed inside the class itself okay inside the class inside the constructor i'm just uh, calling this method guys okay i'm simply calling this method you see I, i'll be able to access it inside the class i am able to access okay i'm able to call this method a from the inside the class but when i try to access it outside the class this method a which is specified with private access mod modifier from outside the class i'm getting a compiler error Similar thing is there with the constructor also. This is a constructor, guys, which is having the same name as the class name, right? If I make this uh, public to private, immediately when I save it, I can get a compiler error here, okay? While creating the object, you see, this constructor need to be called, right? But since this constructor is of uh, what you call private type, I'm not able to, I'm getting some compiler error here, okay? Since this constructor is private type, Okay, I cannot create, I cannot call this from the object creation statement. This is not possible now. Okay, so we have to remove this part, guys. Okay, up to this is only possible. When I, when I try to call constructor from the object creation statement, I'm getting a compiler error. What, what was the compiler error? The constructor is not visible. The same error, guys. Okay, the same compiler error because this constructor is now private. Can I access this constructor from within the class? Yes, I can do that, guys. Okay, what I will do simply is I'll create an object uh, for. Uh, Class A inside the same class itself, I'm creating the object in one of the methods. New class A. Now A object dot. I can access anything, guys. Okay. I can access A object dot A. Okay. System dot dot print A object uh, dot A. Then I can call this uh, constructor also. Okay. This constructor is already called. When you create an object here, you see the constructor is automatically called here. And uh, I'm not getting an error because this is private. You can only access the private specified variables, methods, and uh, constructors within the class. But when you try to access them from outside the class, you will get compiler errors. Okay? So it is not possible. So the private access modifier specified variables, methods, and constructors cannot be accessed outside the class. They are restricted to the class in which they got created. So this is how, guys, we have to use private access modifier in Java. In the next video session, I'll explain 
how to use the next access modifier that is protected access modifier in java so that's it guys see you in the next video session thank you bye